Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to QCR. Today on QCR, we're going to be making smoked queso. I'm gonna show you the ingredient list right here. So we got our Velveeta. We got our ground chuck. I put it in this so that, you know, the package leaks. We're gonna use some bacon, Jimmy Dean hot breakfast sausage, jalapenos, Philadelphia cream cheese, Rotel, thing of cream of mushroom. We got some onions, Tillamook sharp cheddar, Kraft mozzarella, and I'm gonna show you how to do everything. Very first thing we're gonna do is get our bacon cut up into little pieces. We're gonna do it in our cast iron skillet. While our bacon's cooking, we're gonna cut up our jalapenos and some of our onion. So for my bacon. I got these little scissors here. We're gonna cut into little pieces. It's better than trying to chop it. See me cutting these wonderful little pieces here. Oh, and I got a microphone, so I don't know if you can hear me better or if it's hear me breathing louder. I'm not sure yet. First time trying it out. All right, guys. So we got our bacon and our cast iron here. We're gonna start cooking that up. We're gonna cut this onion. I'm not very good at cutting onions, so we're gonna give it a shot anyways. So we're gonna cut the end of it off. Like such. Ah, some more. We'll get some more. Okay. Cut that off. Take the skin off. Nobody wants a skinny onion. Alright, so we removed the 18 layers of skin from the onion. So let's cut it into some pieces. That's probably plenty for our mission today. So we're just gonna, they don't have to be the world's best pieces. It's all gonna get mixed up. Don't panic. Then we take our little onion pieces, put them in our pan, just like that. So next, what we got is our jalapenos, jalapenos here. I don't know if these, how hot these are gonna be. So let's cut them right down the middle. We're gonna take out some of the seeds. We don't want it too hot. Right guys? Stir the bacon around a little bit. Now let's cut these jalapenos up a little bit. I'm trying to find out, is that a lot? I don't know if that's a lot. Be plenty. Let's add our jalapenos right in here. It's not as pretty as it is on TikTok, but you get the gist. All right, what I gotta do next is open up our Velveeta. Cut this down to little pieces. Perfect, perfect little pieces. Little chunks like that. This is some nasty stuff. I'm gonna put it in our little tray. Cut them in half again. There's enough room in this tray. Perfect. So we got everything cut up in our 
dish that we need to get cut up. Now we're gonna put the meat, ground chuck, in with the bacon. That bacon going real good. Ground chuck. Better just to take the scissors, cut this bad boy all the way in two, just like that. Side comes off. That side comes off. Perfect. This goes in the trash. Mix it up. All right, so while we got this uh, hamburger meat and breakfast sausage and bacon cooking up, take our filly and an opener up, just like such. I'm gonna plop it in this pan over here. I know you can't see it, but I don't feel like I can move my camera yet. Take our filly, plop. So here's our pan with the jalapenos and onions and Philly and cheese. Cream of mushroom. In the pan. Cream of mushroom in the pan. And then get a can opener for my Rotel. All right guys, so we got our Rotel opened up here. We're gonna dump it in the pan. Uh-oh, this pan's getting filled up fast. All right. Goes there, put that in the pan. I need a paper towel. So here's what our pan looks like so far. We're just gonna put the meat on there and then put it in the smoker. I think there's plenty of room. This is trash, this is trash. All right, so we're gonna continue stirring. We got our smoker going already. So we got some good smoke in there. Keep stirring this meat. All right guys, what I decided to do is I got this bigger pan here. I'm gonna put this pan inside this overflow pan. So what's gonna happen is when I put on the smoker, it's gonna get hot and liquidy and melty and this is gonna get flimsy and nasty. So I got a carrying pan to hold this so it don't go all crazy. Hi everybody, so what we got here is a package of taco seasoning. Take our taco seasoning, put it in here with our meat, just like such. Stir it around. Want it to cook in real good. All right, now it's time to pour the meat in here. We're gonna keep all the juices in there. Let it all flow in there. Well, it's starting to stick. That's not good. Get that out. Shovel that over there. It was working real good too. We got some Tillamook cheddar we're gonna put on top. How much? All of it. Okay, mozzarella, mozzarella. Where's that gonna go, QCR? Right on top of that. Just like that, oh goodness. That is gonna be a full dish. Look at that. Oh man, that's gonna be good when it melts down. All right, let's go outside. So we put it in there on top, we're gonna let it smoke. I got the uh, cherry smoking wood here from HEB. A lot in there, smoking up pretty good. I'm gonna close it down. Turn the fire down a little bit. It don't need to be that much. We want about 200, a little above 200. It's a little hot, we're gonna let it cool off a little bit. We're gonna come back every 30 minutes, check on it. All right, everyone, look at that. Look at that, look how delightful. Look at all that grease. We're gonna have to stir that around a little bit. Let me get a spoon. So actually, it was a little too hot. 
It stayed at like 300. Way too hot. It cooked in like an hour. Mmm. And good thing I had this secondary pan because it was a little flimsy. Look how good that is. Oh my goodness. Get that cream cheese flowing. Oh man, look at that. Look at all that. Alright, it's almost time to sample it. Almost time to sample it. Alright, so for our chips, let's turn this thing around. Alright, for our chips, we have on the border. And we have Tostitos bite sized chips. We're gonna try these. We're gonna try a little one at first. Just a little bit here. Mm -mm. Man, that's real good. That's real good stuff, guys. Definitely recommend it. Let's try it. Try with the uh, Texas or the on the border. I guess it's not a Texas chip. They got it in Arizona also. Look at that. Oh, I just dripped it on my floor. Mmm. -mm. That's real good. Look at his belly. Oh my goodness. I might just eat on this all day long. I might share it with my sister, but I'll know later. I'm not sure yet. That's really good stuff, guys. Let's do some more of those torcidos, spike sized. Mmm. Let me try. That's where it's at. That's probably the best queso dip I ever had in my life, right there. Probably the best. Dip it. Mmm. Goodness. So, two pounds of meat. One pound, or two pounds of beef. One pound of breakfast sausage. Two big nose. Like a third of an onion. Uh, the taco seasoning packet. Put some bacon in there. Um, put the Tillamook sharp cheddar. Mozzarella from Kraft. Uh, and a thing of Philadelphia and a thing of Velveeta. What I forget? Is that it? Oh, the mushrooms, the rotel. I use cherry wood, and that's what it looks like. Look at that. Man, that's some good stuff, guys. Let's get a couple more bites of it. A couple more bites of this. Mmm. It's smoky, it's cheesy, it's meaty. That's really good stuff, guys. I appreciate you stopping by my channel. Peace. Oh, make sure you give me a thumbs up, guys, at the bottom. Give me a thumbs up, share it with your friends. That's really good stuff. All right, guys, thanks for stopping by. Bye.